opening with the king's pawn controls the center and opens up the light squared bishop and queen, often leading to sharp games. e5 is a common response that establishes a presence in the center, controls d4, and opens up the queen and dark squared bishop. nf3 develops the knight toward the center, attacks the e5 pawn, and prepares to castle. nc6 develops the knight toward the center, protects the pawn on e5, and eyes the d4 square. The Rui Lopez opening develops the bishop to immediately attack the knight on c6, the lone defender of the e5 pawn. Nf6 develops the knight and attacks the undefended e4 pawn. Castling gets the king out of the center and activates the rook. Bc5 develops the bishop to an active square where it controls the center and attacks the f2 pawn. C3 prepares the d4 pawn push and opens up the c2 square, but allows black to capture the pawn on e4. Castling develops a rook, while also moving the king to safety. Castling to the same side of the board as the opponent tends to lead to less sharp positions as compared with opposite side castling. This threatens to win a bishop. This moves the bishop to safety. This maintains the balance in material with a good trade. This is the only move that works. This develops a piece while also winning a tempo on a knight. This moves the knight to safety. It is the last book move. This is the strongest option. It is best. This ignores an opportunity to prepare a bishop for development. It is an inaccuracy. This move puts the bishop on a safer square. It is best. This prepares the bishop for development. It is best. That's fine. It is good. This activates a piece and simultaneously wins time by attacking an opposing queen. It is best. This move puts the queen on a safer square. This threatens to kick a knight. It is best. This captures a vulnerable pawn. It is best. Recaptures. It is best. Takes back. It is best. This activates a bishop by developing it off of its starting square. It is best. This offers to exchange pieces of equal value. This threatens to win a pawn. It is excellent. This is an equal trade. This stops the opponent from being able to win a pawn. It is good. Recaptures. It is best. That's what I would have recommended. It is best. This loses material. It is a blunder. This misses a great but hard to find move. This misses a chance to obtain a winning position. This overlooks an opportunity to win material. It is a miss. Takes back. It is best. This develops a piece while also winning a tempo on a bishop. It is best. This moves the bishop to safety. It is best. Right on target. It is best. This fights against the opposing rook for the open file. It is good. This wins a tempo by threatening a bishop and forcing it to move away. It is best. After all captures, this is an equal trade. It is good. Recaptures. It is best. This activates a rook by getting it to the 7th rank and also restricts the opponent's king. It is excellent. This misses an opportunity to block an attack on a vulnerable pawn. It is a mistake. This offers to exchange pieces of equal value. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. That pawn was free for the taking. It is best. This forces doubled pawns in front of the opponent's king, decreasing its safety and harming the pawn structure. It is best. Takes back. This is the start of the end game and white is equal. It is best. A very strong play. It is excellent. This threatens to take an open file with a rook. It is excellent. This takes an open file, a common method for activating a rook. This is the only good move. This threatens to activate a rook by getting it to the 7th rank. This stops the opponent from being able to take an open file with a rook. It is a great move. This threatens to create a passed pawn. It is excellent. This forks multiple pieces. It is best. 
This defends a pawn that was under attack and had no defenders. This threatens to create a passed pawn. It is best. This maintains the balance in material with a good trade. It is best. This activates a rook by getting it to the 7th rank and also restricts the opponent's king. It is best. This connects the rooks, which helps them coordinate together in the future. It is best. This protects the attacked pawn. It is best. Very precise. It is best. This moves the pawn to safety. It is best. This threatens to win a pawn. It is best. This is the strongest option. It is best. One of the best moves. It is excellent. That's what I would have recommended. It is best. The rooks can see each other now, allowing them to provide mutual defense. It is best. Recaptures. It is best. Takes back. It is best. A solid choice. It is excellent. Right on target. It is best. That was a free pawn. It is best. That's a sensible reply. It is excellent. This places a rook on the 7th rank, activating the rook and restricting the opponent's king. It is best. This activates the king in the end game by getting it off of the back rank. It is best. The passed pawn moves towards its goal. It is best. Giveaway one player was winning, but then gave it away. That game was pretty competitive. Black had a good opening, but white was on another level. Black found some nice moves in the middle game. Both players had incredible precision in the end game. 